The first question is from Mr. Edward Ngulu. He's from Uganda. Yes. Uh, his question is, he says, I am a Christian. I have lived together with Muslims in Uganda since I was very young. Uh, sadly, believers of most faiths, including Christianity and Islam, have been identified with wars and conflict. What advice can you offer people of all faiths? Personally, I think that uh, no religion can be identified with wars and bloodshed. It's always the political powers which exploits religions and uh, cause bloodshed and atrocity upon others. So it's always done in a very clever disguise by the politician. If politician did not interfere, there would not be any religious war at all. That is my first answer. And the second one is that sometimes some religious uh, bigots or zealots are known to have caused disruption of all sorts, but they do not belong to the original true religion at all. Because at the sources, none of relig other religions preach violence against humankind. So these two answers perhaps will suffice, will cover the entire area. The only advice is return to your origin, return to your sources of religion and then you'll find nothing but peace there.